All right, so. It's been a minute. But before I get into these cards, I have a message. I am picking up on someone's energy that is I'm picking up on someone's energy that is holding rage holding rage within their heart But the rage comes from hurt. And it's rage that they spill out to others. Comes from an inner child place within their heart. Deep, deep within their heart. This rage is contagious, it's powerful, it's pure, it's almost like childlike, like it's been held for so long. It's been held for so long that it has now caused an disease this ease within the body. There are circumstances in this person's life that they could never forgive. There were circumstances in this person's life that they never got clarity on. Why would this person treat me that way? Why would my relative do me that way? As an innocent child, why would I be treated that way? God says you are in a state or a point in your life where forgiveness is a must. Forgiveness is a must. You seem to be holding on unforgiveness to or from people that have already passed on to the other side. You seem to be holding off to forgiveness from people that have actually said they have apologized. But it wasn't enough for you. You did not express that it wasn't enough. You just went, I guess, went on with life thinking it's over, done with, it's okay. But that seed was still planted in you. Those seeds are still planted in you. And they have grown into an illness.
God said this message must come out because somebody is asking why. Why me? Why me? Why now? Why? 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 And it's because of the unforgiveness that you allow to plant and grow within your heart. God says there's a forest. I didn't want to say that. I I really didn't want to say that. But God says there's a forest that you have allowed to grow within your heart that has caused blockages. Blockages for sun or love to come in. And blockages for you to show your true love to others. This this dis-ease in your body can be cured. It can be cured. The first step is acknowledging. Acknowledging this this dis-ease, this illness that you are carrying in your body is a result of your doing. It has nothing to do with no one else. It has nothing to do with those products. It has nothing to do with the label. It has nothing to do with bottling is what I'm hearing. This illness is about the way you handle unforgiveness. And God says you can cure it. You can cure it by just acknowledging first. These steps are acknowledging first. That you are not a victim. None of us are victims. If we are spiritual beings having a human experience, we can't be victims. We are having experiences that allow us to grow, that allow us to gain more knowledge, that allow us to have more wisdom and compassion for others. But we should never carry a victim mentality. That victim mentality and unforgiveness has gotten or has produced this ease or illness within your body. Release the victim mentality. Acknowledge your responsibility. When you start with that, when you let it all go, when you cry it all out, and I can see someone crying now. When you cry it all out, get up and proceed on a quest of forgiveness. If you must go to these people and say, I was holding on to this for so long. This has caused me to do this. This has allowed me to do this. But now I know I am not a victim. I forgive you. When you can say those words out to anyone you feel that have harmed you, you can begin to clear that illness within your body.
at the same time fasting is required according to what God tells you to do and prayer will also be required because holding on to so much unforgiveness for so long is not going to come out that quickly or easily so make sure you pray gather stones uh, whatever you need crystals to help you in this manner <clears throat> but you can be healed and will be healed God is telling me if you put in the work to release the victim mentality and forgive those that have hurt you all right so i think i'm going to cut it here that's going to be one video and then we're going to start again with 